Did you know that over 17 million people in the U.S. had a depressive episode in 2017? That's a huge number and shows just how important the treatment of depression is in the United States. While the go-to treatment for depression is currently medication, there are a lot of alternative therapies that show a lot of promise. Neurofeedback is one of these therapies, which has shown strong research-backed evidence in its potential to relieve depressive symptoms. The rationale for using neurofeedback to help depression comes from robust evidence that suggests that people with depression actually have less brain activity in their left frontal lobe. The left frontal lobe is associated with positive emotions and motivation behavior. So a lack of activity there correlates with a strong tendency to focus on negative emotions and withdrawal behavior, like you see in depression. By increasing the amount of brain activity in the left frontal lobe, researchers have actually shown a great reduction in depressive symptoms. Not only does neurofeedback tend to reduce depressive symptoms, but the effects can actually last for months to years after you receive training. Typically, people who do neurofeedback for depression start to see results around 10 sessions in, but they usually continue to receive a total of around 20 to 25 sessions.